Hey guys, Stealth here, and welcome back to Broken Arrow, the open beta. Um, we are going to be playing the um, power plant map. I'm not exactly sure about the exact term. I have, of course, the VDV slash armored deck ready. And we are fighting a group of other Russians. Now, let's see how well this is going to go. The uh, capture zones seem pretty condensed. You really only got these three and then a fourth over here. Sorry, a fifth over there. Um, let's see. Let's see. We spawn in fairly close. Yeah, we got two guys ready to go in there. I'll take this flank then. I might be able to get there pretty quick if I bring a couple of infantry guys on helicopters. I'm thinking a couple of uh, VDV. Let's go inside the MI-35 so I at least get some sort of fire support. And deploy these over here. It's two I-35s. I do want to have a form of ground support. Uh, slash anti-air. Let's get a Kamas with anti-air. Let's get a Metis in a concourse. That's fine. And of course, we're going to have to bring some reconnaissance. Uh, Razvetka in a cargo. And let's see, what else do I need? Sniper. It could be very useful over here. Trying to find spots where the enemy could be sneaking. Such as over here. Although these lines of sight, not great. In case you don't know how to do this, hold Alt and you're going to get this overview. This is actually a pretty decent spot, but maybe not for a sniper. Uh, let me just park a... No. I'm going to park a Sarmat over there. Maybe send some infantry. Something that's not terribly expensive. Send a Metis over there. Not in a concourse, though. Uh, I'll take a Metis in a... Oh. I can't afford that. Very well. Very well. Alright, here we go. Everybody's jumping in. I'm going to capture this as quickly as possible. Line of sight wise, these buildings are pretty awful. You're going to have to control the whole area here. If you want to do anything useful. I'm going to put my forces over there and then pull the helos back a bit. We've got the other guys coming in. That is Vetka. I'm going to drop these off here. I'm seeing not a ton of enemy fighters slash planes, so I don't really expect to have to do much about that yet. Let's bring in a BMPT. Great for mowing down enemy infantry if and when we catch them out in the open. Now, let's not linger too long. Yes, I want to capture the area, but I'm not strictly planning on sticking around. I want to have a forward defense, so this building over here would be very suitable for concourse. This one slightly... Yeah, maybe some concourse, although... Over there, this area is a bit fragile. This would be great for an infantry ambush as well. Um, I think two of them is going to be a bit much. Let's summon back to base. You're going to hover over here. Let's get the Razvetka to go this way. We have three out of five zones. The only thing we haven't captured yet is the middle. Uh, let's see. Do I want to go to the middle? Not really. I don't really find that I want to spread my attention too much. Oh, we got somebody para-dropping here. That's excellent. So I don't have to go to the middle. Good. Sarmat's almost in position. We got the Conquest team moving in. You guys can move up. I do want to have a tank here. Armata's a bit expensive for what I'm thinking. So let's bring a UM. Hello. There's Sarmat over there. Get in here. I'm not sure yet what they're packing, but it's probably not going to be terribly friendly. Uh, this cargo can go back to base. Bring some more infantry in. Um, quite a much struck with a boomerang. Boomerang fire support infantry just for general slaying of things. Let's go. Sprint these guys over to the next building. You guys hunt on the way there. You might be able to do something useful here. Hunt. Enemy drone coming in. Oh, now we got the now we got the baddies coming in. Uh, you guys might need to run. Smoke up and run away. Get some sports. I'd like some supplies. I'm staying here. Oh, there's a Barbaros over there. Yeah, that's gonna be uh, a bit much. And a tour fallback. We're gonna bring another UM. These guys have been all but killed. Got the Conqueror's team in position. Let's get these over there. 
got the Igla in position. Let's put those over there. We got our, let's say, second line in position here. Yeah, this Conqueror is going to sit over here. This Sarmat's going to sit over here. And after that, this guy is going to fast move. There's the Tor. Oh, he's going for the Hilo. Change altitude. Drop, 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 drop. Okay, it did take some damage, but... Can you still hit that? No, you're going for something else. Yeah, he's going for the other MR-35. That's fine. That's fine. That's not yet my problem. Although I do want to take this guy down, of course. Now, this map's pretty wide over on the left. So I might be able to do some flanking here and intercept units here. So let's start working on that. Let's get a couple of VDV going over there. Two guys in one transport ought to do it. Uh, this position for the Conquerors is not great. For now, it'll have to do. Let's get another Razvetka over here. You guys can start pushing. I'm going to take this position for ambush purposes. We've got the four out of five sectors, so, so far so good. We've got the Terminator over there. T-80 and the Boomerang are moving up. I want the Boomerang to unload, let's say, here and start sneaking the infantry through the woods. That's the Guardi Monstrauki, so we do have 24... No, we got four RPGs. That's a whole lot. These guys get six. It's a bit more useful. Let's get this guy going back to base. I'm not using all the hotkeys yet, as you might see, because... I'm not that well versed in all of them yet. Uh, let's get a cheap NTR unit. Derivatsi has 130 points. Standard Igla, it's not that expensive. Put that over... Yeah, over here. And I can move this Krejet over there. Uh, hello. Can I help you with something? Drop off now. Get back. Back, 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 back. That's the UM. There's the boomerang, and that's my dead terminator. Back, 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 back. Nope, too late. You have to disengage from this road now. Let's get a vehicle. I want something that's not terribly expensive, that can still pack a punch. Based on my points and the threat level, I'm thinking another UM. I know I have two UMs going, but I don't mind that. Let's go. You need to drop off now. You guys are getting back up to full strength. Let's go. You can go back home. Now, I did call in the T-80 UM here. That's excellent timing. This guy can go home. Oh, we're losing this sector here. Okay. That's something I'm going to have to look into, but not at the moment. I'm going to trust my allies to hold that position and just focus on bolstering my own ground over there. He's going home. He's bringing in the new VDV. Uh, let's drop off the VDV here. And then get some supports. How about getting a Vena? Airwise, I do have the SU-25. It is coming equipped with a couple of 500 kilogram bombs, so with that, you should be able to pack a punch. The SG-57, sheer fighter setup, and the IL-76 as a cargo plane is not armed. Razvatka, uh, drop off here. And the Typhoon can go back to base. You over there. You go over here. I'm very happy to have saved the Gvardi Modestrelki. Could be useful. Now, let's get a drone over here. Let's get an Orion. Did I arm my Orion or not? Yeah, I put Vickers on it. One. One Vicker. Somebody's pointing to a big line over there. So this is last date. Of course, it's over here from somebody else. Now, it is currently not the most stable game. I have had a couple of disconnects happen, so it is possible that we're going to see players, or rather units, not move, simply because the player has disconnected. 
from what I have heard, the devs are working hard at it. So it is something that we're just going to have to put up with for the time being. Scratch it. Please go over here. Drop off your forces over there. Oh, now they're bringing bigger guns. Do they still have missiles? One. No, two. Oh, that's beautiful. There's the tour. Let's pull this guy back to base. <laughs> In bits. You can fall back. You can start hunting. These are very dead. Smoke up. Yeah, we're gonna get pushed out of here pretty hard. They're using two T-80 UMs. They got air cover. So that's not something I can really use. I mean, they got... Um, not strictly air cover, but they have a tour. This is going to take too much damage. Reverse. What's the hotkey for that? X. Okay. Boom. Okay, you're going to reverse to there. The other MI-35 is the one I sold off. They're going to start capturing my supplies. I need to do something about this guy. Uh... SG-25T is not the most optimal, but it might be able to do something against these tanks. And if it then dies, well, tough luck, but uh, I can live with that. Let's get some more infantrymen over here. Let's get the... Yeah, let's get the Gvardi. I'm gonna get two of those to boomerang, or two boomerangs to be exact. There's the Vena. The Vena is slightly out of position. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> Very dead. After you fired, relocate. Where's my SU? My SU is taking a lot of missile attention, and it's gone. There's the tour. That's the one I'm trying to get killed. That's the one I want gone. Let's get the Armada in. Start dealing with those T-80 UMs. Whatever variant of the T-80 they happen to be. There's Igla and Cornet. Oh, really? Go run and intercept these guys. I don't want them anywhere near my position. That covers anti-air and it covers anti-tank. I don't like either of those. Let's hit that with Artie. There's two tours now. And an Ente. Ooh, nice. So that's gone. And there's the other tour. Beautiful. Go and get this tank pulled back. Let's get some supplies for it. Not too many. I don't want to send, spend a whole lot on that. Wait. You guys are getting butchered. Go. Oh, it's the damn tank. It's the UM doing all the damage. Okay, fair enough. Hit this guy with a... Nope, hit these. Do not let them move up. This building might give me options. Let's go. Run. Here's my new infantry. And there's the tour. Get it. Nice. Tour down. Smoke. The only smoke I got. Let's run out. These VDV guys over here in the forest did a lot of work for me. I really appreciate them. Keep hitting this building. No, thank you. Run. Infantry feels really quite squishy. KA-52? Okay. It's immediately getting hit by the Igla. Come on. Oh, no, this is Krasia doing that. But that, there we go, was the Igla team. Alright, gentlemen. Let's start unloading here. And here, please don't attack this. Shouldn't have put that over there. Um, other infantry. The VDV come with the RPG-7. I think these guys with the RPG-28 are more punishing. Let's get another squad in. Ah, there we go. There we go. I need more eyes. I'm blind over here. 
Let's go get an Orion drone. I know that there is a bunch of tours around, or at least there were. I'm not so sure if there still are. Jeez, they have a huge defensive line. Why don't you take the territory with that? Nice. Keep hitting it. There's supplies over there. It's good damage on the Amada. Again. Gone. Beautiful. Pull back a bit. Let the infantry move up a little bit. And let's get a Terminator involved. Start mowing down the enemy infantry inside here. We got a 25T coming this way. Which is getting promptly hammered by extremely long range anti air. That's the Antes. Okay. I'm gonna have this destroyed. That's the logistics. I'm gonna get those things nailed. These boomerangs are only armed with a cord, so they're not that great in the rule that I have for them. Sent them back home. Um, I'm going to save up for a Barbaris, because those things have a ton of firepower. and can be extremely, extremely useful for what I have in mind for them. Get in the building. Boomerangs are leaving. That was a missile from the Orion, I think. Ooh, get out. If you still can, get out. Pull back a bit with your armada. Still need more points for the Barbaris. You drop off. Just where you were. And then go back to base. Okay, the infantry is leaving. We're going to push up. Gentlemen, run. Reverse the tank. Put some more fire support over on the positions where I think they're going to be. The UM's getting fixed. There's more infantry coming up. We're going to keep rushing with these vehicles. Really? We cannot jump building to build? Okay. That's uh, a little unfortunate, but here we are. Now they got three stars. They got three of the pips. Time to get mine back. Get here. Get some recon involved. I want a Razvetka and I want snipery. Uh, I don't strictly want those in a helo, though. Let's get the sniper... Oh, I think they're already in. Drop off these guys here. Get the tank involved. Have the Vena start peppering that boomerang. The UM can roll back in. This is never going to win. Yeah, okay, the boomerang can leave. Oh, they know I'm here. Run. Oh boy. Did I bring any bigger already in this deck? No, I did not. Okay. I'm gonna have to double up on the mortars then. Get these guys over here. Start hunting down these boomerangs and whatever else they happen to have. Yeah, get rid of the infantry. Quick. That speed things up. Uh, the Vena is in position. Where's the... There's the Terminator. No, thank you. Reverse. Ooh, this guy's gonna be dead pretty soon. Reverse all the way. You're gonna get two supplies. Go. Nice ambush with the Rosvetka. Well done on their side. Well done. There's a ton here. What the hell is all that about? Oh, they got the Armada. Crap. Okay. What did they use for that? Just boomerangs? What, with ATGMs then? Because I can't really explain it away any other way than that. At least we're getting our zone back, which is nice. But now my fire support's a little light. Get another uh, UM. Do not let these guys get a foothold. Unacceptable. Get him. Really? Okay. 
You are out of HE shells. Lovely. Okay, I did bring in logistics, so we're going to retask those logistics to go here. This guy might be able to provide some fire support. Get him over there. Got the Zvetka over here. Put the snipers over there. My zone is the contested one here. Wow. <laughs> That's expensive. Two books? Shame if something happened to that. Real shame. Okay, uh, let's get the zone back. <laughs> that is Vetka here in this ambush position. Boom. Boom. One book down. That is beautiful. Okay, let's get some more infantry. Uh, I'm just going to use a Kamas for that. I'll take three of them over there. Oh, multiple Kamas. Okay, fine. Terminators are ready. Get this Sarmat to scout out and see what I can hunt down. Maybe. Hold on. Use the Sarmat over there. And get them a Sprut. Okay, we got four for five again. We just need to get that last sector. Not really my department. I do want to get another logistics unit over here to try and keep the area. Because it's just a matter of time until they start pushing again. Okay, there's now double. You can go back to base. It's a bit quiet. I don't like it. Because I am suspecting that quiet means they're prepping something. And all I got is a Terminator and an MI-8 gunship. I hope this is enough supplies. Yeah, it should be. Here's the UM. Let's put the UM behind the building over there. Where's this Terminator exactly? Oh, they can't see it. That's good, they can't see it yet. Okay. We have more infantry coming in. It should be here. Yeah, there's the VDV. Drop those off there. Drop the other VDV off, let's say, here. Where exactly is that mortar? Like, over there? I don't got the range for that. Okay. Mm. Oh, here we go again. They're laying a smoke screen. They're definitely planning something. They are definitely planning something. Here comes the Barbaras. Let's get a second Terminator. Because I'm expecting a lot of infantry. Potentially more than I can currently take down. Okay, you can go back to base. You can start hunting. Yep, there's a UM. Oh boy. Uh, infantry. I'm gonna get two Metis teams. Let's go. Look at all these boomerangs just sitting here. I did get a Logi truck over here with supplies. I might not want them at the moment because it's going to be a little unsafe to get them there. Because as it happens... Oh, hello. Push. Push. Yeah, it's one big vehicle swarm. Reverse. Put the supplies here, behind the building, so I can use that as a staging ground. Reverse the Terminator. Never mind. Hit this with the mortars. Use the other mortar over there. Boom. It's another boomerang down. I want you to take out this guy. Ooh, close. Yep, got him. That cost him a lot of points. Push back. 
push him right back. Got the Barbaris? Yeah. Right. Let's go. These guys can come back. This thing's just so heavily armored. <laughs> it's bananas. How are you supposed to take that down? Absolutely bananas. Okay. So I held that. Uh, over here, my Sprut and Tarmat, Sarmat, can now start hunting. These guys have expended all of their RPG ammo. Wow. That is some serious explosions. Second Terminator should be here quickly. Yeah, there's the Terminator. Um, do I want to get another UM? Not really. I'm going to get an engineering squad in here in the uh, Barbaris. What I think might have happened is most of his infantry died. Oh. Okay. Most of his infantry died and he started rushing the vehicles that he had left. I'm guessing that's what happened. I want you to go over here. Bring your counterpart. You're going to just walk over here and get the supplies. I need to get more recon in here because I'm still blind. The Zvetka goes there. Here's the double concourse. Uh, position wise, I'm going to say one concourse over there. One concourse over here. I'd like to take this building. And just put a lot more power onto that power that position over there. Just a lot more pressure. But at the moment, I don't feel like I have that yet. One Rosvetka group. Request denied. Reverse. I don't like this Tupolev lingering over here. I don't like that at all. Let's go hunt this way. What is that? That's a cruise missile strike from the Tupolev, isn't it? That might be what that is. Isn't that lovely? Okay, you guys are loading up RPGs again. Uh, Helo. Of all the things I have covered, air is not one of them. Let's get the other Igla team out here. Yeah, it's definitely cruise missiles. Thankfully, they don't seem to be particularly accurate. Isn't it beautiful that a helicopter is going to get taken down by sniper fire? That is lovely. Okay. Yep, there's the helo again. Hunt. I'm going to see if I can get their artillery. I know it's very dangerous to hunt with a Sprut, but it's kind of the cheapest vehicle I have available for that. Uh, do we have something that can carry supplies? No, not really. Okay, you make your way over here. The Barbaris is on the way. We got the Venus resupplied. We got the Typhoon coming in. We should have access to the Armata again, although it's currently a little out of my budget hold. It's gonna take a lot of damage from the rocket pods. Not great. Now we got four for five. Where's that last sector again? Here. All the way over there? Okay, great. That's going to be a little bit too much to chew up, I think. Um, let's start being a bit more aggressive here. This is a terrible position for the HGM. But it's an okay position for the AA position. Let's get these guys moving. Taking fire from something. If we're getting smoked up like this... Then I suspect trouble will be on the way. Retask these. Like I'm holding it with a skeleton force. There's eight men in there. That's all that I have. It's really nothing spectacular. Let's get these in a typhoon. These do have ATGMs. They got the Atakas. So with that, if a tank shows up, I might be able to do something. The Ingenieri Sturmoviki. If something happens to come close, we're going to really hold their own with that shotgun. Put this back a little bit. Now, I know that I could be pushing, but at the moment, I don't really feel the need. 
I find it a bit more valuable at this point in the game just to be defensive. Because the ball is squarely in their court. I don't have to do a whole lot. They do. They have to take their territory. I don't. Let's get Logi. Where are all my trucks at? Here's one. Go pick this up. Go bring it over there. Here's the Razvetka. Drop them off. Yeah, just anywhere. Go back to base. Where's that? Where is that Morty? Here. Can't quite hit that. Yeah, this position is definitely getting hit. Let's put the snipers back. Now you get the hell out of here. And you fall back a little bit to get resupplied. There we go. We're getting healed up. There is definitely a lot of trouble up there in those woods. And even with the Razvetka here, I cannot see it. Let's push them up a little bit more then. Mortar is engaging. Skrejad has arrived. Let's put them over there. Here, actually. What did we kill? I'm not sure we killed anything, actually. Ah, we hit the MI-8. Maybe with these. The guys on the right seem to be really holding the front line now. There's a lot of arenas out there. Damn, five of them? Let's see if I can play around with the 25. I'm going to have to keep my left side on my side. My left side of the screen to at least figure out what is going on there. These guys have the arena, so they have APS. Ought to be fun. That bird. Here it is. Now the problem with suddenly switching side is that I have no idea what's going on here. As in, I have no clue about how much NTR there is or isn't in this particular area. So in that sense, it's a risky move here. But arenas like these, high value target. Nothing happening on my side. Not sure why we're not popping missiles. Do I need to fly lower? There's the arena again. No, we're going right back up to altitude. Come on. Oh, I think it's gone. Oh, now you start dropping. That's a bit late. Don't use those. Those laser guided bombs. Those are farmer for precision targets. What? Okay. The Vickers we should be able to use, right? It's not anything that... It's not a precision strike. It's not a bombing run. It's not a strafing run. Wait, can we laze for ourselves? Because the SJ-25 is equipped with a laser designator. At least this variant is. Oh, here we go again. That Tupolev is up to no good. I feel like we're getting softened up. Get this guy out of here. Start hunting. Five kilometer range. We should start opening up right about now. Hit. Kill. Beautiful. Now get out. Ideally intact. But that's a bit of a stretch. I swear these guys were full health not too long ago. Ah, uh, Razvetka. The Razvetka that I had died, of course. So they're air or anti air. Ooh! Oh, hello. Is that what we're doing? Uh, let's get a Vickers in here. Mounted on a K52. You're gonna pull right back. You're gonna pull right back. 
This line of sight should be okay. This line of sight should be okay. If that armata wants to come out and play, it's welcome to have a go. There's the Barbaris. There's the attackers going out. Nope, it's the Barbaris gone. At least my side is. And here is their push. There's the Amata and the Ingenieri. He's using the right units, I'd say. Um, yeah. We have missiles, we just don't line of sight here. Eliminate the Ingenieri. Kill the infantry, because then they can't push very well. That helo better start getting here quick. Go. Missile away. Second missile away. Some damage on the Armata. Okay, now you're going to change altitude and pop right back down. Nope, 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 nope. Hold on. I think this thing is a bit too aggressive for its own good. Pop up. Don't push forward with the K-52. Do not push forward. Kill it from over here. Nope, lost line of sight. Okay, go there. Change altitude. Logistics-wise, how are we doing? This site has been weakened to some extent. Let's pull this back. The Conqueror's vehicle. I swear something's trying to blow holes in my units, but... Ah, snipery. Nope. My side is pretty weak here now. Let's get another concours. Let's put him over there. Ah, the Buratino has arrived. And that's the rest of my infantry gone. Okay, fair enough. Uh, let's get these guys in on the commas. Doesn't have to be terribly expensive. Another sniper team and another commas. Damn it. I'm gonna keep those. Terminator back. Terminator can probably take the hits, but I don't want to take any chances. Reverse. Oh wow, the pilot's actually still here. Damn, getting him back to base is uh, going to take a while. Unless I use a vehicle, like the Typhoon. We've got eight minutes left. There's an IL-76 that's... That's going to drop off troops? How do you imagine that? You don't. <laughs> okay. SU-34. He's also going to have a very warm reception, I guess. Oh, you're back. Okay. Okay, let's get an Orion circling over here. Just to get some additional line of sight. Pull back these. Um, feels like they stopped shelling this position mostly. Getting additional forces in there is going to be tricky. Oh, I lost my mortars. That happened when I wasn't paying attention. Let's get this back. Hold on. That position that was trying to reinforce is no longer safe. I can save up for an armada, but it's going to take me four minutes before I get there. All right. Um, that's going to make it a bit more difficult. Got snipers deployed there. The other guys, I guess, over there. You're going to go back to base. Let's hope that that works for bringing the crew home as well. Oh, supplies. Oh, Ryan's getting murdered. That was some serious anti-air. What I really do not want to have happen is that they start taking these buildings and then flank me into this direction. So I'm trying to prevent that. All right, you can go back to base. Bunkers can stay. You popping down. 
you've been here for a little while too long. We're about two minutes out from getting an armato myself. There's a Terminator coming in. This one met this guy. He is leading a very blessed life. How long that persists, I have no idea. How much can you see from here? Not a whole lot. If I put this guy over here... Yeah, let's do that. Maybe from this position, that K-52 can function as a sort of very low hovering um, AT position. One that's not that easy to take down, unless you bring NTR right to the front. Which is dangerous. Hold on, they took a third? Oh, they're taking that side. Okay. A few more points. I'm back in business with the Armada. I'm expecting a pretty full-blown assault here. I want you to hold fire. Excuse me. Boomerang. Last time he used those in, in swarms, like in droves. I'm not sure what we're going to see this time around. Could be droves again. Let's get the Armata. Though the Armata does... The Armata does struggle with dealing damage to itself. So in that sense, perhaps the Armata is not the best choice. Let's get you sneaking through. And so much as you can sneak with a full-blown assault shield. Got four minutes left. Supplies. There's the tour. And a Panzer, no less. I like their gear expensive. Ooh. There's the Armata. The K-52 is doing exactly what I was hoping it would. Which is engage these guys from afar. Unfortunately... We happen to be hitting buildings. Good lord. Armata took some damage from the K-52. Ooh. So far, so good. Move up a little bit. No line of sight. Alright. Pull back. Pop back down again as well. That worked out very well. I like that. That worked out very, very well. You're going to sit over here. UM's already getting fixed up. You can go back to base. The Metis can go over here. So that was their response to this group of Ingenieri moving forward. Ah. There's the full-blown response. Mm. Get one of these. BRM-3. I haven't used these yet. 1,000 spawning range. Same for the sniper. But the snipers over here can't actually see anything. Which surprises me, really. Oh. Oh. Scratch that. Scratch that. We have targets. Oh, shit. I'm out of missiles. Okay, fine. You go back to base. We're going to get another one. Um, That's going to have to be the MI-28, then. I feel like the K-52 did very well there. Not a whole lot more I could have wanted from that particular unit. Let's get the Armata over here. Wow, this is aggressive. Oh, two Armatas. <laughs> Rushing forward into the woods. That is extremely straightforward. Now, as I have the deck set up right now, I think I'm missing some artillery units. I don't have enough, let's say... Outreach capability. Armata opening up. Here come the missiles. Pop your smoke. Just let them waste their missiles. We're gonna try that again. Oh, they smoked up themselves. Ah, there's their Armata. Hello. Have I got a friend for you? I really need to see that Armata, though. Come on. You want to fight? Let's fight. Let's fight. There's a Terminator. It's not what I'm hoping to kill. 
but if it happens to show up, I'll do it. No, we're not going to lose this area in the last couple of minutes. I'm not doing that. Uh, let's get infantry in. Pull back. You're engaging the Barbaris with moderate effect. Well, I might have killed the Terminator over there. Get this back. Get some supplies in. There's another arty salvo from what I suspect is the Buratino. Pull this back. Put this here. Pop you down. Tree line cover. Once again, I have no reconnaissance. But there's the BRM-3K. That is extremely unwelcome. Oh, hello. Is this their last ditch attack? Ooh, side shot. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh it's the Armata as well. Yeah, this is their last blown attack and the last second of the game. Gone. Well. That went okay, but I still lost more than I actually killed, which I'm a bit surprised about. I think, however, this is not telling the whole story because the way that I did it, um, I think I used more infantry than he did. And with that, potentially, I was able to get uh, more of my units lost that way. I would like to see this result screen expanded a little bit more. But then again, it's just the open beta. So, that is the Broken Era open beta. I'm really enjoying playing. I really want to play more and I want to get a lot better at the game. So hopefully in a couple of games time, you'll see a whole different type of stealth. Thank you for watching this one. I hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you soon for more.